Next up, we have the gorgeous and talented Ms. Cracker. How are you, my love? Miss Cracker is here. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, America, it's time for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's a reference to your viral video oh. of you making dinner. Yes, that video of me screaming time for dinner is proof that you don't know what part of you is good. America decides. Okay, I would never, <laughs> I would never have known people were going to like that. What a so. disturbing statement, but oh. so true. <laughs> so, well, yeah, I guess it worked for Trump. <laughs> wah, wah. Mm. I guess we're going there. Um, we are where you went. There. Let's bring it back to something a little bit more positive. Okay. Your beautiful outfit. Can oh, you tell the you. people about the inspiration behind it? Well, retrofuturism is my thing. Anything that I think people in the 50s or 60s or 40s would have imagined when they thought about the future. Mm -hmm. So Metropolis or the Jetsons or Flash Gordon, mm -hmm. that's my thing. So that's what I'm bringing today. It's fabulous. Boy, were they wrong. Yeah, they were wrong. <laughs> I love somebody. But the fashion maintains its gorgeous. They were optimistic, yeah. <laughs> um, we have some questions from Facebook. I'm ready. First off, from Dita, how long have you been doing drag? I believe okay. I have been doing drag for seven years. <gasps> and I was talked into it by Bob the Drag Queen. Oh my, so a legacy. This is her fault, basically. <laughs> yeah. We blame her. Yes, oh absolutely. Why do you only think seven years? The first two were a blur? Well, okay, I... I never can keep any numbers in my head, so I believe it was 2011, if I'm correct. So that would make that seven years, right? Yeah. Well done. We're not mathematicians. Though. Yeah, girl, I do <laughs> hair, not math problems. <laughs> um, next up, from Timothy, what is your favorite drag race season ever besides your own? Oh, I mean, season six. Because yeah. uh, Bianca Del Rio set the standard for how to behave, I think, as a drag queen. She was cruel when the time required it, and she was kind when someone needed a hand. Yeah. And to be able to do one or the other is great, but to be able to do both, that's greatness. Yeah. So that's why I love that season. Yeah, no one quite strikes the balance quite like Bianca. Oh, no. Amazing. Yeah, no one can be as mean or as nice, <laughs> by comparison. Do you consider yourself a mean and a nice queen? Well, I certainly hope so, but sometimes, you know, it tips one way or the other, depending <laughs> on how many hours of sleep I've had. We're all just humans <laughs> underneath all the spackling. Absolutely, allegedly. <laughs> um, okay, one more question. Z wants to know, what is your favorite era for fashion? You've kind of already answered this. Yeah, no, so that, that moment, that far from heaven, like 40s to 50s mm -hmm. moment, I think, um, th and there's so many queens on Drag Race that claim to love that vintage moment, <laughs> um, but they emphasize that bright and bubbly mm. part of the housewife look. And for me, that moment is so incredible because there's so much sadness yeah. and isolation mm -hmm. in it, and that's the part that I like. I feel like Trixie Mattel in that all my jokes in fashion are a cry for help, as <laughs> Trixie said, like, and that is exactly how I am. So that's what I love about that moment in fashion. There's nothing quite as glamorous as sadness and depression. Oh, absolutely. There. Yeah. <laughs> Tears are just emotional crystals, you know? <gasps> Rhinestone your face. I love it. Well, I can't wait to see you on this season of Drag Race. I've been a huge fan of yours in New York. I remember us bonding over Kate Bush oh, many absolutely. years ago. Yes. <laughs> when I first saw you perform, I was like, I have to drag this person around everywhere I go because you are just, you do not care what people expect. You want the unexpected. And you gave me my it. first and probably only Manhattan booking for like a good couple of years. See, I do she give back. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Thank you so <laughs> thank much. Thank you so I love much, you. honey. I love you. Right through your little pierced heart. Oh, thank you. <laughs>